So, it's time to grout now. So we've got a large section here, which we can get on with. So we're using the Marshall's exterior jointing grout <coughs> with 425 mils of water. We're gonna pull that into there. And use this whisk then to mix it all up. When it's all mixed up, got a nice slurry. We're gonna just fan a bit of water over the top, just to moisten the top a little bit. Then we can start pouring out the um, slurry and um, start rubbing her in and I'll show you how to do it. Right, okay, so let's get some of this stuff in there. Looks like a nice powdery type material. Pour all that in. Oh, and there we go, it's always splashes the last bit. Swine. So, give a good mix up now. This is actually a 2 by one for Marshalls. They're being so damn good. down there, drop it in and rub it round. about 20 minutes to set, rub it all in, fill up all the joints, then give it another light hosing down to get any excess material off the top of the slab, or tile I should say. What I've had to do with the corners here, I've had to block up the holes so it doesn't seep through. The last thing you want is all the grout seeping through onto the floor. 
Okay, so we spread it round. Oh, I just want to give it a light sprayed over again so I can get any of the excess uh, fans off the cloud. get off as much as possible because this stuff really does set super super quick within half hour it'll be rock solid and the actual strength of the material a pally if I remember rightly it was the equivalent of 53 newtons which is pretty damn strong considering a concrete block strength is 60 newtons so it's almost as strong as a concrete block which is great because otherwise you get the weeds coming through and then that would really spoil it it's all laid on a full cement bed so weeds should never be a problem but it's just nice to know that it's just really really strong now it's starting to look technology this otherwise you used to have the polymeric cement which is like a resiny type based stuff it just never went hard enough but you can guarantee this stuff marshals jointing grout fantastic It's the type of thing as well, you can't just sit down and relax, you've got to keep on top of it. Because if you leave it too long and it goes off, you won't get it off. And then you just ruined a perfectly good ceramic patio. And it's not the cheapest stuff in the world, so... But I would also say, this type of thing leads to the professionals. So I'll just leave that dry for a couple more minutes, then I'll put the cleaner on her again and start washing everything off the top. But it's looking pretty good so far, isn't it? It does what it says on the tin. So we just did an extra little bit of squeegeeing off camera, don't want to bore you too much with it. But we've hosed it down now twice. So now we just need to wipe everything off the top and this should be the final piece. <laughs>
really nicely now. The cement in the joint should be pretty hard already. Well, I'm going to get the majority of it off now. Then I'll go back over one more time just to 